Welcome back to another episode. I am very excited to share this one because I went out with um, Luck of the Irish, Captain Omar. Um, we took a friend of mine and we actually, um, we obviously we wanted to catch some fish and fill the freezer, but the whole purpose of this particular trip um, was for, so we could film an advertisement or a commercial for Omar and his business and we had a blast. Um, I got a lot of footage um, in for that, but anyway, um, that was kind of why this one, this uh, video, this whole video was pretty laid back and there wasn't a whole lot being said, but essentially what we did is we bounced around on some main lake points and even went to uh, some big rocks up on the, the dam. We were looking in the main lake for some sand bass and we ended up finding a quite the large group or several groups. Um, it took us a little while to get on them that morning, but then once we did, it was hot action. And what the fish were doing was they were running this point back and forth anywhere between like 15 and 25 foot of water. So we'd catch them up a little bit shallower, like 15 to 18 foot of water, and then they'd move out on us. So we'd have to move out with them, and then we'd start catching them, catching them, catching them, and then they'd move back up. I assume that what I think that they were doing is that they were using that, that long point and that shallow shallower water to run these bait fish back and forth along that point so super cool and it's uh, fun to share that kind of thing with you guys so it's not you're not just sitting there watching us catch fish like this is the reason why we were doing it we were on a main lake point before i go too much further though i wanted to share today's verse of the day with you guys it comes from second timothy chapter 3 verse 16 through 17 it says all scripture is inspired by god and is useful to teach us what is true to make us realize what is wrong in our lives it corrects us when we are wrong and teaches us to do what is right god uses it to prepare and equip his people to do every good work and that is awesome um, i am a sinner i was born into sin and all human beings are with the exception of our lord and savior and with that being said I am so thankful that I have a book to guide me in my life. They call it the Holy Bible. You guys should pick it up sometime. Now, let's jump into today's video. Uh, right before we do, go ahead and check out Omar Carter and Luck of the Irish, North Texas Fishing. It's all of his uh, social media and all that stuff is down in the description below. Guys, book a trip with him. You will fill the freezer. And if you decide you don't want to fill the freezer and you just want to catch fish, he's great at that too. <laughs> so uh, hit him up and uh, let's get into today's video. Oh yeah, it's a good fish. I love it when they stick their fins up like there. Can I have? Can I see that fish with a big smile on your face? <laughs> oh. <laughs> the drag strip and I was like, oh, here oh, we yeah, go. Yeah. <laughs> the biggest hybrid I've had somebody catch was on Cedar Creek in the fall. And it was, it was a little over 13. About 29 inches long. Yup. Yeah, it's okay. We'll do the grease flip later. 
Hook got him, the other hook yeah. swung around like, yeah, yeah, where do you think you're going? Uh, nowhere. Okay. <laughs> yep. You know how to tell the difference between the hybrid and sand bass, don't you? If you look at a hybrid, it may break up on, along the way, but on a hybrid, they all go all the way to the tail. They don't, they don't fade out on the right. way to the tail. Go all the way there. I like, I like catching fish almost as long as my You got something going on? Yeah, there? I do. <laughs> Like this, shoot me a message. 
message or I'll have him tagged in the video, of course. And uh, we'll get you set up. Yep. That's uh, round number two. We've already got a big bunch up here. Too. I call Omar the professional fish cleaner. How about that? I've seen him do both sides of sand bass in under a minute. <laughs> That's fast. Just take that. And like I say, we'll clean it up. And man, that is just some good eating right there. What a morning. Amen. I enjoyed it very, very much. Hey, Bryce, you want to be in it? All of the Luck of the Irish information, social media will all be down in the description below. Check out Brush, Brother, out, Brush Brothers Outdoors as well. One of my very good friends in the whole wide world is, and this man here as well. A great friend of mine and we got to do some fishing this morning and we had a fantastic time. So, you guys got any uh, closing words? Just uh, remember that uh, it's right here. This is the day before. Day that Christ rose. That's right. You know, you just don't, nothing compares to that, but it sure is a wonderful thing to get out here and be able to enjoy his creation with uh, two fine young men. And they're the kind of men that uh, gives me a lot of hope for this country that uh, even like God told Elijah, I have 10,000 you don't even know about. That's right. And so we're all out here together and we all just need to find a way to love each other despite ourselves. Exactly. He paid a price that uh, we could never repay, and for that we are eternally grateful. So I enjoyed it. Hope Love you guys. Love you guys. Love you guys. Appreciate, Appreciate y'all for watching, and uh, we've got lots to come in the future from us. Lots Amen. and lots of stuff to come. Again, if you guys want to book a trip, all the information is down below. You can get a hold of me, and I can help relay um, you guys to the captain here. Yeah, and we can uh, get it taken care of. If things work out the way I want to, he may be your captain. Yeah, we'll see. We're, we're working on it. We're talking about it. And uh, definitely in the plans. So we'll see how it all goes. But you guys are awesome. Thank you so much for watching. And we'll see you in just a few days.